Hi, I'm Tso Seng Kwan. Hi, I'm Kai Yun Fui. We are going to present about USB. First, we want to talk about the concept of the data transfer. The data transfer rate is the amount of the digital data that is moved from one place to another in a given time. The data transfer rate can be measured as a peak of the travel of a given amount of the data from one place to another. Now we want to talk about the difference between the sprint measure and the fast side measure. Sprint measure use the unit of the bit per second, but the fast side measure use the unit of the byte per second. So in January, we can say that one byte has a bit. Next, we want to talk about the demonstration of the data transfer rate calculation. Data transfer rate is equal to the total data transfer per time taken. For example, we are given a scenario a USB is transferred a file which is 500 megabyte in 2 minutes. We may solve the problem with 3 steps. First step, we must change the unit. We must change the megabyte to megabit, and then we must change the minute to second. Secondly, we must apply the formula data transfer rate equal to the total data transfer per time taken. Thirdly, we must do the calculation data transfer rate is equal to 5000 megabits per 120 seconds, which is 33.33 megabits per second. Thus, you can say that the USB has transferred the rate, which is about the 33.33 megabits per second. Next, we want to talk about the USB mission. There are five USB instruments we use to compare, which are USB 1.1, 2.0, 3.0, 3.1, and 3.2. The difference of the USB mission is caused by the connection speed. The older USB cannot maintain high connection speed depending on the computer itself cannot run that faster. The high amount of the data transfer require parallel connection, which are those are not enough. The comparison of performance between USB mission. First of all, to compare the performance, we fill the table with time taken with the greatest performance. This means that we ensure that everything is transferred with the highest speed. It is clear to see that the higher the USB version, the higher the data transfer rate. But what we want is not just the speed, if not the winner is USB 3.2 and not need to compare anymore. We should find the optimization with price and speed. Our aim is finding the optimization between time taken and the price, so we take under 10 seconds for the acceptance line for the time taken. We would conclude that the MP4 music and YouTube video which is in 5 megabytes and 10 megabytes are transferred within 10 seconds for all version of USB, so everything is just working fine. The song, album and episode TV show are most suitable to transfer with USB 2.0 and later on version of USB. Because if we use the USB 1.1, it will take more than one minute and this may result in the user experience. The movie in DVD, which is in 4.5 GB, it is suggested to use USB 3.0 and further version. This is due to with the USB 2.0 and earlier it takes quite more time. The movie which is in HD resolution could use USB 3.1 and USB 3.2 to transfer. This is because the data transfer could complete in 10 seconds. So who is the winner in this comparison? USB 3.2? If we compare the price and connector, we could find that the winner in this comparison is USB 3.1. The USB 3.2 could be the faster in this comparison, but it has two weaknesses. It requires Type-C connector, which is still rarely, and it is expensive. The USB 3.1 could run requirement in satisfied time taken and support in USB A, Type B, and Type C. USB Type B is the most common type of USB and can find almost any computer. Furthermore, if the device is older with the USB Type B, it could still support in a slower speed, and all of this is cannot be done in USB 3.2. So, as a conclusion, in my view. The USB 3.1 would be the greatest USB.